Recently, India has passed the Right to Education Act, and the Right to Education Act requires every child in India to receive quality education. And uh, this is a huge challenge for the education system. And to face this challenge, it's important that we have the required number of teachers in every school. In addition, we need to also make sure that the quality of teacher education is good enough for the teacher to be equipped for this task. When you talk of role of technology, I think uh, it was Karnataka and looking at Karnataka, several other states also followed the model of engaging an external agency uh, for education delivery and maintenance. So it's a very large investment that government of Karnataka and government of India is making to see that you know computer literacy is brought among the students. At the same time, the other objective of taking technology to the classroom that is not happening to a very large extent. I think now at this point of time, we uh, at least uh, the system is realizing that outsourcing was not uh, the right way to do it. And now we could have uh, built in the capacity of our own people to see that it happens. So now under STF, we are trying to switch gears and try to see that how ownership could be brought to the school rather than remaining with the agency. ಒಟ್ಟಾರೆ ಈ ತರಬೇತಿಯ ಮುಖ್ಯ ಉದ್ದೇಶ ಏನಿತ್ತು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ಶಿಕ್ಷಕರೆಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ಒಂದು ವೇದಿಕೆಯನ್ನು ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ಮಾಡೋದು ಅವರ ಅನುಮಾನಗಳನ್ನು ಪರಿಹರಿಸ್ಕೋಬಹುದು ಮತ್ತು ಅವರ ಅನುಭವಗಳನ್ನು ಹಂಚಿಕೊಳ್ಳೋದು ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಇದೆಲ್ಲದರ ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಇವೆಲ್ಲವನ್ನು ನಾವು ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ನಾವು ಖಂಡಿತವಾಗಿ ನಾವು ಈ ತಂತ್ರಜ್ಞಾನ ಬಳಸಿಕೊಳ್ಳೇಬೇಕು ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರಿಂಗ್ ವರ್ಕ್ ಶಾಪ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅಟ್ ದಿ ಬ್ಲಾಕ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಕ್ಲಸ್ಟರ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಇನ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ನೋ ನಾಟ್ ಡಿಸ್ಲೋಕೇಟಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವರ್ಕ್ ಮೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ನೆಟ್ವರ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಅನದರ್ ಆಲ್ಟರ್ನೇಟಿವ್ ಮೆಥಡಾಲಜಿ ವೇರ್ ಅನ್ ನೆಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಸೊ ದೇರ್ ಬೈ ಇಫ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡನ್ ಸಮ್ ಹಾರ್ಡ್ ವರ್ಕ್ and if i am able to share with the whole teaching fraternity the abundance of knowledge that could be created would be enormous another important use of technology is to see technology as a enabler for resource construction mhrd guidelines keep talking about local resource contextual resources but we know textbooks are centrally created but with digital technologies a variety of tools are available can actually be used by teachers to create resources tantrajnana nanu modlu stf training hagodikinta modlu tantrajnana ant helidre videos torsodu presentation madodu slide show torsodu ashte ant ankondide ittichige stf hogi banda nantara nanu simulations na kuda adapt maadkolade shuru madidene ಸಿಮ್ಯುಲೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಮತ್ತು ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳೋದ್ರಿಂದ ಖಂಡಿತ ಮಕ್ಕಳಲ್ಲಿ ಆಸಕ್ತಿ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ನಿಜವಾಗ್ಲೇ ಅವರು ಮಾಡಿ ಕಲಿ ಅಂತ ಅನ್ನೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಹತ್ತತ್ರ ಹೋಗ್ತಾರೆ ನಾನು ಮಾಡಿ ಕಲಿತಾರೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಕ್ಕಾಲ ಹತ್ತತ್ರ ಹೋಗ್ತಾರೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ said that the subject teacher forum tries to use a variety of digital methods now the nature of digital tools that we use is extremely important in education sharing and collaborating is a very essence of teaching learning textbooks are publicly owned however when it comes to software unfortunately we are used to using software which is proprietary proprietary means that we don't own it we have only been given a license to use it fortunately we find that for all the proprietary software that we are using whether it's operating system or office we have equally good if not better uh, free and open source tools which are made by the free software community so it is uh, a, what we call a public software meaning that it's free to share it belongs to all of us so just like we have a public education system we are saying that the software that the public system should use should also be publicly owned the greatest advantage that uh, i see is you know one is in terms of the attack of virus uh, the whatever data that is stored it is not going to be corrupted second advantage that i see is in terms of the costing uh, third advantage that i see is in terms of you know uh, when the software is being upgraded i don't have to procure procure a new version for that you know in this you know there is no upgradation happens by itself you know 
So, thereby I see uh, three at least distinct advantages. The advantages could be much more than that. If they are able to make use of the educational tools that are available, free of cost, uh, and they are able to uh, do that classroom practices or class learning process in the classroom in that fashion, I think it would be a great uh, you know, move forward. And lo looking at the website, the way in which they have been able to access these tools and the way in which they have been able to develop the activities, I think I am totally enthused.